Greetings from Mexico. Let's check in with Teresa who has an art show on her door celebrating a trip to Mexico. Show us your room which is also all done up here on the Carnival Glory. Very nicely done for a trip to Mexico. Now, how do you like your cabin here, your inside cabin on the Carnival Glory cruise ship? Well, I think they couldn't have picked a better name. We've got the gorgeous room, we've got ample space, we've got all these memory pictures of where we were. Uh, Ryan's even celebrating his Mexican heritage, which he just, he, I guess he's an adopted child. <laughs> to Mexico because he adores it. We are bringing this beautiful sombrero home from us uh, from the port of Cozumel. We visited Florida, Mexico, Belize, and the beautiful country of Honduras. Now you were very excited to see South Beach, Miami, Florida. What was so surprising about seeing that area of Florida? Because it's real. And so built up, you I've, didn't expect I've seen South it Beach. on television and people speaking of it, but when you, it's like a doubting Thomas, I saw it. And it's, it's worth its weight in gold. <laughs> and here is South Beach, Miami. Then we went past Cuba. What was it like to see Cuba? We didn't actually get off of the boat, but you were able to see Cuba from the window? Yes, we, uh, they said it was about 100 miles away. 90 miles. For us, we were approximately about 50 miles away and we could see it. And then you went over to this port of Cozumel, Mexico, where you saw a large supermarket. What was so enjoyable about seeing a supermarket I, I, in Mexico? I'm beginning to wonder why they have such huge ones. Perhaps it's easier to satisfy the health codes. This was as large as our Costco's in New York, in the United States. It really was something else. And then a beautiful walk alongside of the waterfront in Mexico. And then the next stop was the country of Belize. What did you enjoy in Belize? Well, That's the, the trip where you took a tender boat. In order to get there we took a tender and that was, oh god, that was great. We were exciting, the water was blue, we were all getting splashed and it held about over 100 people. So it was quite large. Now speaking of blue, after that you went to the very wonderful blue and white flag of Honduras. Yes. yes. Now, what um, was that like? That was exciting. We went on a trip into the... You took a tour? You a tour. From the port of Roatan. We, we scoured the inside of the island to find the most precious and the most prominent Honduras shirt. And we found one. <laughs> it looks identical to the flag. And now Costa Maya, you went back to Mexico to visit the Yucatan Peninsula area. What was it like seeing Costa Maya? That was equally as very nice and you have many people from countries all over the world vacationing there. It was something else. Now that had a, the Malecon where all the walking alongside of the beach mm -hmm. was. How, how, how long would you say that stretch was and how enjoyable was that for you? At least two miles long. All beach yeah, and resort all and beach, fun. All beach. All beach. Now let's talk about how was your cabin? Did you find this to be comfortable for you? Comfortable, entert uh, um, entertaining, it, us, it was perfect. And we even picked up some more decorations along the way. Uh, we have our Mexican themed garland which came to us from a party here on the boat. Now let's talk about the rate for this trip here in particular. Coming from New York having to fly to Miami and then the price of a trip like this. Can our, you give us both? Our flight per person is $352. From New York to Miami. New, and our seven day trip here is $721.91. And that's with all of your a taxes, total, tips, and. A total figure coming out to just not even $100. About $100 a day. $100 a day. And let's see, the total price is $1,073.91 per person per day for a seven day trip visiting these here ports. And I want you to show us the restroom area here and tell us, did you feel like this was uh, easy for you to get in and out oh, of the shower? Very, very much so. Very adequate and you felt safe. You had all kinds of bells and whistles should you need them. Um, the lighting is great. The and more decorations. Shelves. 
I see. And also now you are a big winner. You won a whole bunch of things on the trip at different events. A bathrobe, I won a, a bathrobe. bottle of champagne. I want a bottle of champagne a and, watch. I, and I just want a, want a wristwatch. And also, aside from this big, beautiful sombrero, we did pick up an authentic Mexican blanket from the port of Costa Maya. So there was fun off of the ship and off on land. I hope you come out and enjoy the same thing that we're enjoying. It's good. <laughs> That's it, everybody. It's Ryan and Teresa visiting the beautiful country of Mexico from Florida. We wish you were here. Till next time.